15 AAA titles are scheduled to release on the Nintendo Switch within this year and 2018. Let's check them out right now. Splatoon 2 Set two years after the first game, your favorite Inklings are back in another turf war. Return to this third-person 4v4 shooter that oozes with color and chaos. Take a splat with your ink-filled artillery and choose from its wide variety of memorable characters. This time, the territorial feud goes askew. Brotherhood and friendships will be tested and families will be torn apart. Perhaps the game's latest addition is its motion control and shooting. Players can now dual-wield their weapons to neutralize the enemy turf faster. Aside from that, use your Joy-Con to position your aim better. Additionally, its new mode Salmon Run lets you team up with 2-4 to four of your friends in an effort to survive an onslaught of Salmonids. The game is coming very soon this July 21st. Mario plus Rabbids Kingdom Battle Now this is the kind of game that no one expected. To make it short, this is a crossover of Ubisoft's adorable Rabbids and Nintendo's Poster Boys mixed with XCOM gameplay. Together, they bring you a game inspired by Firaxis' XCOM series. As silly as it may sound, it kinda worked. Even the game's creator went emotional during the presentation. One word of advice, it may look kiddy on the outside, but with XCOM's mechanics, it's brutal and unforgiving. Choose from a wide set of characters including Mario, Luigi, and a rabid version of Princess Peach, and more. But before any of that, remove their respective platforming features and bring out the big guns. Using their cover-based combat, go in a tactical turn-based firefight with your enemies. Mind the percentages because this game is set to release this August 29th. The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild DLC This year has been a great time for Zelda fans. With the release of their universally acclaimed Breath of the Wild, they're expecting a DLC worthy of the game itself. Fortunately for them, Nintendo is gearing up for more content with DLCs Pack 1 and 2. Pack 1 contains a new sacred mission called the Trial of the Sword. This quest takes you to a dungeon and stripped of your equipment to survive a gauntlet of challenges. You can also track your progress, finally, with this new map feature called Hero's Path Mode. If the challenge is too easy, you can always pick the new hard mode and feel the brutality. Additionally, you can retrieve new outfits that can help Link in his journey and stat building. It's the first set of DLCs set to release this summer of 2017. And as for Pack 2, it's coming sometime next year and features new stories about the Guardians of Hyrule. NBA 2K18 Shoot some hoops and experience 2K's annual basketball game on a Nintendo Switch. This high-caliber sports game is about to show its performance on Nintendo's latest console. Not enough details were revealed during the game's announcement, but our boys Shaq and Kyrie are this game's covers. Expect enhanced game modes, tweak physics, and improve visuals for a seemingly realistic basketball game. It's pretty much understandable. With Nintendo's Joy-Con, things will turn out very unique, especially with its built-in motion controls. We're currently itching to get more details about this game soon, and with 2K, who knows what kind of surprises they're keeping for us. It's set to release this September 19th. Pokémon Tournament Deluxe there is never any doubt, We use odd mixture of Tekken Combat and Pokemon is making its way to the Nintendo Switch. It was one of the Wii U's best-selling fighting games, making it a necessary purchase for Pokemon and fighting game fans alike. Experience Pokemon like never before. Instead of the regular turn-based battles, face off your opponent with Tekken's mechanics. Perform your insane combos, juggles, and punish your enemy Pokemon to a pulp. This will get the same special treatment like Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. It features a whole new set of playable characters such as Decidueye, Darkrai, Scizor, Empoleon, and much more. Set to release this September 22nd. Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2 Sorry Switch users, this is the closest thing you can get for a sweet Dragon Ball fighting game that's not Fighter Z. Anyway, the Switch port of the badass fighting game from Bandai Namco is ready to show Nintendo what their console is capable of. It's just like any of your ports. However, the game will offer frame rate variations for the docking features of the Switch. Players will experience a smooth 60 FPS with singular battles and 30 FPS during multiple ones. During the dock mode, the game displays at a crisp 900p limitation and 720p for the handheld. Once again, if you can't play Arc System's very own Dragon Ball game, then pick this one instead. It's set to release this third quarter of 2017. Fire Emblem Warriors Intelligent Games and Koei Tecmo combine their iconic games into a fast-paced hack-and-slash action game set in the Fire Emblem universe. Take control of various characters from the Fire Emblem cast such as Marth, Xander, Krom, and more. Team up with these fan favorites to unleash devastating attacks and combos against an army of evil monsters. Similar to Hyrule Warriors, the game packs unlockable characters and content that may prove fitting on your adventures. Aside from that, players can tactically change heroes to change the tide of battle. The game is also amiibo supported, which means the players can use their old amiibos for surprises. With two of the best companies in Japan, what could possibly go wrong? It's coming this third quarter of 2017. The Elder Scrolls V Skyrim Todd Howard's favorite game ever is coming to the Switch. 
During the Festus E3 conference, they've been talking about how Skyrim will revolutionize Nintendo's latest platform. It was briefly featured during the Switch's trailer during last year's E3. Fans have been dying to know how Nintendo's console can handle such power. Well, it's finally happening and we can't wait to try it out. The game is packed with all new gameplay features, such as motion control and enhanced lockpicking due to the Joy-Con. These new enhancements make you combat enemies with a single swipe from your controller. Perhaps its biggest surprise is a fully modded version of Link's armor and weapons. When accessed with Amiibo, players can unlock special features of the game, and the rest is up to them. And lastly, the game contains all the add-ons, making it a complete experience. It's coming this third quarter of 2017. Just Dance 2018 Nintendo's newest console won't be fun without Ubisoft's family-friendly party game. All you gotta do is just dance to over 40 tunes from popular artists, including Clean Bandit, Ariana Grande, Nicki Minaj, and more. Use the Joy-Cons motion detecting and sway your hips to the beat of the popular songs of today's generation. Oh, and then we mentioned there's more songs from Asian artists, such as Hyuna, Sai, and Hatsure Miku. So what are you waiting for? Gather your mates and jive with rhythmic enjoyment to this latest craze. It's always fun when you're with friends or alone. Ready your body because this game is coming this October 24th. Super Mario Odyssey This is by far our most anticipated Nintendo Switch game. Their iconic poster boy takes an adventure to Big Apple, a fictional recreation of New York City. Compared to the previous Mario games, this takes inspiration from Super Mario 64 and Sunshine in terms of open-ended exploration. This year's E3 shed a ton of highlights as to how the game works. Mario goes out on a journey with his ship called the Odyssey. He explores the land outside Mushroom Kingdom to rescue Princess Peach from Bowser's wedding plans. Along with you is your magical cap. As you progress through the story, you can throw this cap to transform it into the thing or animal it touches. Even dinosaurs. Use it to solve puzzles, deal with enemies, and more. It's such a fun mechanic that offers new creativity to the franchise. Other than that, not much were revealed, but the game is just around the corner. It comes out this October 27th. Sonic Forces Dr. Eggman has taken over the entire world with his army of robots and it's time for Sonic to muster all the help he could get. But before any of that, get used to the game's two variations of Sonic, modern and classic. The former takes you to a 3D gameplay similar to Sonic Unleashed in colors, while the latter plays like a 2.5D platformer similar to the original Sonic series from the Sega Genesis. Whichever style you pick, it all leads to defeating Eggman, so you have to go fast. This is also the first Sonic game to let you create your own custom character. Imagine the possibilities of teleporting behind the enemy's back. Heh, <laughs> nothing personal. Anyways, this is developed by the team that gave us Sonic Colors and Generations. Let's hope they don't disappoint. It's coming this fourth quarter of 2017. Xenoblade Chronicles 2 It's more than just a simple sequel. This next installment to Nintendo's critically acclaimed science fiction franchise takes you to a whole new adventure. This time, the world is twice as massive compared to its original, making exploration a very rewarding aspect of the game. Face a ton of colossal enemies during your journey and experience the fast-paced combat. The story revolves around two characters called Rex and Pyra. Together, they search for a paradise called Elysium. It's a quest filled with peril, but with gun and sword at your disposal, you have nothing to fear. We can't wait to try this game out with the Switch's hardware. It's coming sometime this fourth quarter of 2017. Untitled Kirby Game Still a working title, this upcoming Kirby game is headed to the Switch. The adorable pink creature with an insatiable appetite goes to an adventure of a lifetime. But the game was announced during Nintendo's Treehouse event. As usual, the gameplay is similar to most of its predecessors. It's a side-scrolling platformer with cuteness overload. The traditional eating and consuming his enemies will grant Kirby some sweet powers. For example, eating a swordsman gives you the ability to wield a sword. But during his adventures, he can recruit new party members with the power of love. We're short on details at the moment, but what we know is the game is scheduled to release this 2018. Untitled Yoshi Game While most of us were awaiting a sequel to the 3DS latest hit, Yoshi's Woolly World, it looks like his Switch, heh, <laughs> to Nintendo's latest console also called for a Switch in aesthetics. Pun intended. Instead of the arny environments of the Woolly World, Yoshi begins his adventures in an adorable new land of paper craft items in miniature worlds. Aside from aesthetics, there's not a whole lot of change in terms of gameplay. Embark on the Green Dinosaur's classic platforming misadventures as he eats up and knocks down enemies with his dino eggs. Roam around the adorable land along with a friend and solve the puzzles of his flipping world. It's set to release sometime in 2018. Metroid Prime 4 Announced during Nintendo's Treehouse event during E3 2017, fans of the popular platformer rejoice as they see their beloved series plastered with a number 4 on the screen. As a simple JPEG file, fans began speculating what could its fourth major installment be. From the game that gave birth to the Metroidvania genre, we're expecting good things. 
that means we get to see Samus in glorious HD. Due to the lack of significant details, we can't talk much about the game. Nintendo has too much games planned for their new beloved console, and who knows what surprises lie in store for us. This will be the first Metroid game to hit the Nintendo Switch, and it's currently in development. It's coming sometime this 2018. You may get these games right now by clicking the links below.